The Bernoulli's principle describes the inverse relationship between lateral wall pressure and velocity as a fluid flows through a conducting system. Swiss scientist Daniel Bernoulli demonstrates the pressure in a liquid or a gas decreases as the liquid or gas moves faster. This is a picture of a centrifugal pump. A centrifugal pump has a rotating impeller to increase the pressure of a fluid. The picture shows the fluid as it enters the suction nozzle. The fluid gets pulled in by the suction vanes of the impeller. The impeller then spins the fluid around at a high pressure and a low velocity. The impeller spins the fluid out of the discharge nozzle at a low pressure and a high velocity. So this picture shows how a pump works by using rotational kinetic energy, typically from an electric motor or turbine, to an increased static fluid pressure, which this action is described by Bernoulli's principle. The picture shown here is a jet nebulizer that uses Bernoulli's principle to convert a pool of liquid into a fine mist of aerosol particles. A jet stream of gas is projected at a high velocity across the end of a capillary tube. The gas jet reduces the pressure at the top of the tube, causing the liquid to move to the top where it is continuously drawn off as aerosol particles that enter the outflow passage of the humidifier. In conclusion, looking at both of the examples shown, the actions of Bernoulli's principle can occur in different ways and fields. This is Monica Vigil from Pickens Tech. This concludes my podcast on Bernoulli's principle.